Hey guys, and welcome back to another episode of Sims 4 City Living. Oh my gosh, I was about to say 100 Baby Challenge. This is not 100 Baby Challenge. Anyway, welcome back. <laughs> Hopefully you guys are having a great day thus far. Yeah. Anyway, we are back with another episode. I am actually pre-recording because last episode I was um, a little bit disappointed by how Reagan ended her last work day. Um... I don't know, like Ahelia's here and she moved in with us on last episode. I didn't even get a chance to show you guys what we did for the bedroom, but we ended up just getting her like a air mattress. It's just like a temporary solution until we get like a more um, permanent solution, if that makes any sense. Um, I was looking at the house and I was like, I could totally make it back into a two bedroom, but oh my gosh, it's already so cramped. I like the flow of it right now. I like that if we want to entertain, we have space to a certain degree. Um, we got the piano so, you know, she could still practice even though she hasn't practiced in a while. But uh, for the most part, you know, I felt like it, it had a good flow. So I didn't want to, you know, switch it up again. We need a place for the computer. I just was looking like there's not enough space for us. So I mean, realistically, I think it's going to be a good move, but it's just, I just don't know how it's going to work yet. But anyway, the house is trashed. Uh, Reagan's mood was just kind of like shot. So I'm just trying to do the best I can at this particular point. She's okay now. She's practicing on her writing, but she definitely wants to do better at work. She does not want to not succeed at what's going on because, oh my gosh, girl, what in the world is this outfit? Are you serious right now? Is this your work outfit? Wait, no, seriously, y'all. This is her work outfit? What the heck? She looks like somebody's grandma. <laughs> I hate to say it. <laughs> and there's nothing wrong with being a grandma, but that's like a very old fashioned, like, yeah. That's like a very, very old fashioned grandma. Anyway, I'm going to pause this real quick before I knew it was going to do that. I knew it was going to start going fast. I was like, I'm going to pause it real quick. Because Ahelia is still asleep, but I'm sure there's things that she needs to do in order to get ready for her first day of work, which will actually be tomorrow. So today we're just going to kind of be hanging out with Ahelia, I guess, is um, what I'm trying to get at. But uh, yeah, I ended up, when I finished recording last week, or last week's episode rather, since it's still this week, uh, I was just like, that's not cool. She didn't get no money last time, none. And we need all the money we could get. And her boss was not happy with her work. So I'm like, she needs to go in and... I hate to say it, but she needs to suck up a little bit. So we're going to, we can either make connection and lowers work performance. No, we need to work hard. Uh, surf web will do what? Uh, just fail. And then represent client. Um, okay. So we do need to eventually represent client because we do want uh, to be able to do what we need to do for Ahelia. Um, I don't know what her mood looks like because um, I was saying on last episode, I don't have the need stuff. I'm not sure what's going on with that. Um, so anyway, I'm gonna have her get up and just kind of clean up and mop and uh, go go throw all that stuff up. If she was the one that got all that water in the first place, when she used to come over and visit, that's all she would do is go get water. <laughs> I don't know if she was thinking like, I don't want to mess up your apartment. So, but anyway, so that's what we're doing right now. I did think that maybe she could sleep in the bed with a uh, with um, Reagan because I think they're close enough friends in order to sleep in the bed together but I wasn't 100 percent sure so I went on to just grab the air mattress just in case I felt like it was more realistic for us just to have like a little temporary something in the meanwhile but I'm going to wake her up and assume that she is okay let's see real quick okay she needs a potty so let's do that too we need to is it broke oh my gosh okay we're just going to replace it because everything in this apartment is just breaking and then we're going to use the bathroom we got to be careful though but i think she can do let's see what does she need to do in order to get ready for work she starts in she needs to research fashion so i'm gonna have her do that when she's finished cleaning up and then i'll probably since we've never played with her before her queue is full right now but since we've never played with her before we don't know much about her i think it'll be kind of cute to um you know kind of have her go around town and just kind of like hang out and everything maybe we'll go to the gucci store and let her go browse of course we're not going to buy anything because we don't we can't afford it <laughs> i mean literally gucci is like 300 dollars, like easy that outfit is like yeah two what is it 256 or two i don't know those just round up to 300 it's expensive so we really don't have the money for her to go buy herself any new outfits and i do want to go in and tweak her outfits because um i only have tweaked one 
And so I don't know if she has like five outfits. She might be wearing the same outfit every single day. And I'm gonna do the same thing I did with Reagan. I'm just gonna give her like a base of, you know, like a base five outfits, just a couple options. And then as we progress in the in the LP, I will be um, letting her buy her some more outfits. Of course, she's gonna be in the fashion industry. So I'm imagining that every once in a while, a designer is going to just, um, you know, give like give her some of the fashion you know what i'm saying that they um have let her wear what have you because in real life that happens like you end up being a model and you're you'll be amused for your um oh my gosh this is gross uh i'm gonna go complain to landlord but um you know they'll they'll be like you know uh, you did so well in the fashion show. I'm just going to give you this fashion. Sure thing. Since you're attendant in good standing, I'll take a look. Okay. Congrats on landing that sweet job. I think it's going to be great for you. Well, thank you, Dominic. I didn't even know we knew Dominic, but okay. <laughs> uh, we probably should familiarize ourselves with the landlords. I'm going to have her actually do that. I'm going to come over here and I'm going to share some ideas. Um, I want her to be... I feel like if we're in good standing with the wait, girl, uh uh, get up. I wanted you to go talk to the landlord. Seriously, go talk to the landlord. Um, okay, good. She's gonna go talk to the landlord a little bit. Um, in her little, <laughs> in her little t shirt, her little dress. Please don't go anywhere, landlord. Okay. Um, she's tense right now. Azumi, all right, let's discuss latest video games. Uh, let's uh do an impression i'm just gonna do some stuff she's tense right now so let me um discuss some interest uh just trying to be very friendly with her hopefully it'll help in the long run you know what i'm saying like <laughs> you scratch my back i scratch your back type situation i'm gonna get to know her a little bit um ask uh i guess ask about her career of course she's a landlord so we know that already but i'm just trying to x out all of our all of our stuff but um, eventually, oh, Penny is always up to, look at this. Do you hear it? You can hear like bed springs and like all sorts of noise and stuff. Yeah, that's Penny Pizzazz for you. <laughs> of course, both of us are like angry. She's like, oh, <laughs> she doesn't even live on this floor. Azumi, you have no idea. There's noises all the time coming from that apartment. Um I'm just going to let them finish talking and then I'm going to go. Oh, she's like, oh, she's feeling sick too. Oh gosh. So she's feeling feverish and she's stuffed up and she's angry about the fact that Penny is in there getting her woohoo on. But the funny thing is like, I don't even like if I go in the apartment right now, well, you know what? No, it did happen one time when I was playing in my free time. One time I went and knocked on the apartment and there was a guy that came out like after she came out. So she might be in there with somebody have no idea have no clue of course we can't see anything i hell you guys learned that azumi is a landlord at san mushino rent company of course so anyway we've i hopefully oh now it's an unpleasant conversation so now it's not working now it's in the red i thought we were doing pretty good so i'm just gonna have her come over here uh career let's find a job um how do we let's go web can research research fashion all right so we're just going to go over here and just kind of ignore that whole little situation it's one thing if you're just like loud but if you're doing this that'd be so embarrassing to go knock on the door and be like i can hear you woohooing outside <laughs> like fyi look how she looked at the door when she walked past she was just like this is annoying um is azumi gonna do anything about it i don't know i hate that i felt like we were doing good conversation wise and then it just went left <laughs> like it went all the way left um anyway did she disappear oh she's in here Girl, what are you doing? What is she doing? I don't know what she's doing. She like came in here to wash her hands, but it's like, why would you? I didn't welcome you in here. Why are we in a negative right now, though? I guess I can apologize. Maybe she chewed her out and I didn't realize that she chewed her out because she was feeling. Okay, so, oh, I didn't get a chance to tell you guys a little bit about her. This is her dad. His name is Ulal or Ulal, I think. Her mom is Demi and she has a little sister, Cadence. And yeah she is a blonde i think she dyed her hair because everybody else is a brunette so i like how she came in here though and she's like <laughs> playing on the computer and everything but you don't like me though you don't like me like that okay you don't um she's tired too y'all so i'm gonna i'm gonna order her some medicine and uh let's order medicine then i'll have her take some um let's just get one fifty dollars oh my god we're gonna be broke in no time we're gonna be broke in no time anyway let's uh take medicine hopefully that'll help her feel a little bit better and then uh we can finish we're almost done researching I'm, i was thinking eventually penny would tire and she would be done 
but she hasn't yet. Is that our mail or is that somebody else's mail? Oh, that's somebody else's mail. So where is our mail? Okay, that's our mailbox right there. Okay, cool. Okay, she's done. So let's see if anybody walks out of the door. <laughs> let's see. Because I really don't think anybody's going to walk out the door. But I'm going to apologize to Zoomy. We need to be on a Zoomy's a, a good side because she is the landlord. Okay, so what's his face walked out of his apartment? I don't see anybody coming out of Penny's apartment yet. Yeah, that's your mail. That's your mail right there. Uh, let's discuss some fashion. Uh, okay. Her queue is still full. Are we done researching fashion? Are we good? Are we still? Oh, we're 50% done. Why is it like we're all the way full? Oh, she's crying. Oh, she's watching a movie. What in, what in the world? How do you just come over here and just start watching a movie and start? Oh, I forgot about uh, Reagan just that quick. Oh, my gosh. Uh, I forgot about Reagan just that quick, y'all. Just that quick. I forgot about her. Um, that's crazy. And she's hungry and she needs to, um, go to sleep and take the medicine and finish talking with Azumi, who I think is about to go. Is she about to leave? Okay. And then let's go on and, um, oh, her queue is still full. She's going to apologize to Azumi and just be like, you know, I'm sorry that I snapped at you. I didn't have her queued up to snap, but she probably just did it on her own. Uh, let's do normal for a little bit. Uh, let's see real quick what she got going on. I guess one good thing about moving Ahelia in is that, oh, we did excellent. We're going to get a, really, we're going to get a promotion today? Wow. Wow. Okay. I wanted to socialize. Let's see. Oh, someone, someone walked out, didn't they? I messed it up. Um, oh, there's Penny. Okay make connections um let's make some connections and then we'll start representing clients since we got the promotion we might as well just kind of just like hang out a little bit you know do some other stuff but okay we're still in the red with her i don't know what to do um i guess let's discuss some interest a little bit oh goodness she's like in a horrible mood like girl you don't have to be here you could go and penny comes out just like whatever like you just went in here wooing your wooing your head. Oh, she's hot headed. Okay, that's probably the reason why. All right, I'm just gonna. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do about this lady. Like she's like in a weird mood, and I'm gonna have her. Uh, we can serve the rep, but now I'm gonna represent client. Now that we've did a little bit of uh, interacting, I think I can have her. Can I just have her cook a salad? Maybe she's a vegetarian, so uh, we need to get a vegetarian option. Yeah, garden salad will probably be like the best thing to do. Isn't that so stereotypical though? I feel like that would be stereotypical. I'm probably like dead wrong, but I feel like that'll be stereotypical that she's a model or she wants to be a model and she's like vegetarian because she's like so concerned. Okay, we can't get a zoomy. We can't get her on a positive at all. There's nothing that we can do. Like she's just like an ugly, mean, like not ugly like face. I mean, but just like ugly spirited, I guess I should say. Because I feel like sometimes when I say ugly people thinking I'm talking about looks. But I'm like, no, attitude, like behavior. <laughs> All right. Reagan bought home 352 simoleons. Golly. Um, it's better than nothing. We did not get a promotion though, but that is okay. So I'm going to. Oh, I guess we could talk to Penny. She's out here in the hey neighbor on board. Want to hang out for a bit? We can socialize or do whatever your heart desires. All right, let's talk with Penny and invite her in. I'm going to bright day. Um, let's. Uh, oh, okay. She totally disappeared. Let's discuss latest video games. I mean, like she didn't give me hardly any time to talk to her. <laughs> and then I'm going to kind of go in here with her and um, sit and chat here for a little bit. Uh, there we go. And then we need to reach the level three of the writing skill. And we also need to network with journalists. So uh, even though Penny's probably going to come over and hang out with, a, for, with us for a little bit, I'm probably going to, oh, I went too far. I'm probably going to have her get on the computer a little bit and do that because, I mean, it's only right. We need to do other stuff. I need to get her back. So she's inspired right now. So this is perfect. Let's practice writing. Is Azumi about to come in here again? Girl, seriously? I mean, she's made herself completely comfortable, but me and Penny are hitting it off. Okay, is the door locked? Why does it keep saying the door is locked? When, what's his face was wanting to come in? Okay, let's see. Locked door. Okay, let me just do this. I'm a locked door for everyone and then go back and unlock. Okay, then hopefully now we can go in and, um, I mean, if Azumi came in, why can't, that's weird. Isn't that weird? Like if she just came in all on her own and we didn't technically invite her in, why in the world would Penny not be able to come in? Isn't that weird? Um, all right. I don't know. Can I call her? Let me see if I can call her over. Um, 
agree to hang out. Oh, agree to hang out. That would make sense. That would make sense. So let me go agree to hang out and then she could come in and then I'll come back and go finish writing and stuff. Um, come on, Reagan. Get up, girl. Get up. Thank you. Get up. She's like waiting for us to come let her in. That's like so that's so awkward like Penny, you're just gonna wait down in the hallway come on and come in penny come on and come in i'm just doing some work but you're welcome to come in so i'm gonna go right here and um let's see let's go and we're gonna write we're gonna practice writing and then we are going to please don't touch my computer though because i do need to work <laughs> I do need to work and let's do some social networking. We need to update social media status. Um, we need to, I don't know what we're updating it for because we really haven't done anything. You know, like I like to update it when she actually does stuff. Let's share an image. Probably just like a picture from the club last night of the Uptown Hookah stuff. And then let's um, network with journalists and so she can get all that stuff taken care of. I'm going to let Ahalia, she's like in such a weird mood because she's tired. But I'm going to let her kind of interact with Penny for a little bit. Uh, let's evangelize some vegetarian benefits. She seems to like that. Uh, tell a funny story. She wants to paint, which that might be an option. We can do um, some easel painting because that's like something that she wants to do. Um we should definitely talk to Penny about fashion because it seems like Penny would love to have a conversation about fashion. She seems like she's a fashionable sim. Like she pushes the limits of uh, of, of fashion, you know, <laughs> with some of her fashion choices. Um, Try to see if there's anything else in here. I felt like there was something else you're supposed to get with the uh, fashion career mod. Like you're supposed to get something else, but I can't remember. Let's debate some game strategy. Let's. Oh, she's talking about. <laughs> commitment girl let me get to know her a little bit um like girl i heard you over there are you single like i should ask her if she's single but i wish there was like a platonic is there a platonic single like let me know if there's a platonic single because i want to just ask i mean when i mean when i say that i mean like can we ask somebody are they single without it being like a romantic thing like i feel like we should be able to do that i know there's like a platonic woohoo like or we could just woohoo with anybody so why isn't there a, a platonic um i'm a i don't want to complain about problems i'm a bright day a little bit uh is she gonna finish eating that salad are you gonna eat your salad girl uh let's see how reagan is doing she's almost at the level three threshold which is perfect 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 so as soon as she gets there i'm just gonna x her out i didn't realize all her skills well i did know some of her skills were that high but uh writing yep she's almost there y'all she's almost there almost there as soon as she's done i'm, I'm xing her out because i want her to be able to talk and hang out with penny oh, awesome stop you're done. <laughs> You're done, girl. So that's probably the reason why she didn't get a promotion is because we didn't get that taken care of. So we got that taken care of now. So next time we go, we should totally get a promotion. Um, I mean, it feels like, and I don't know, correct me if I'm wrong, but it feels like we're getting um, promotions really, really easily with this career. Like, I don't remember being this easy with any other career, but kind of want to go in and grab a picture of Ahelia and Penny. They seem to be hitting it off a lot. Oh, Oh, just 25. Oh my gosh, what is going on? I feel like if I start a Ahelia, uh, what you call it, she's going to like knock it out the dog on park. Um, yeah, I don't know. I'm just going to take a picture real quick. Because I'm I, sometimes I always forget to take pictures and I'm like, what am I using for the thumbnail? I don't know. <laughs> With a little bit, with a little bit of luck and perfect timing, your social media update, status update has intrigued the world. It said, "Martin has heard you got a promotion." Oh, thanks, Dad. Oh, yeah. You know what? I think I'm gonna let her go by herself. What you guys think? Yeah, I'm gonna go with Martin, and we're going to go hang out with Dad by ourselves. I think that would be fun. We didn't get a promotion recently, though, but maybe he's talking about like last time. So let's go meet up with him, and I'll be right back. All right, guys, we are at the restaurant with Dad, and I think we picked. The only thing that's going to annoy me about this whole restaurant thing is that, of course, he invited us out, but watch, I have to pay for it. So, anyway, let's go over here. Um, he's probably like, "Well, you got the promotion. You're you're big stuff right now. So let's just go request a table, and uh, go sit out and sit out and uh, sit out. That don't even make no sense. We could have just got this table right here, but go sit and kind of chill out. It's so funny that she's like in this dress. I need to update." I don't want to because I feel like I need to like let her go through her own little discovery type thing. But this dress looks like a prom dress. It looks like a bride. Oh, sorry. It looks like a bridesmaid's dress or a prom dress of some sort. I don't know. Why in the world do we have a negative interaction? Because, oh, my God, Reagan is just what in the world, y'all? 
So Haley is back at the apartment, just like entertaining people. Um, it's so funny because I was saying that I was going to spend time with her and kind of like get to know her a little bit on this episode. And then dad hit us with the, I heard you got a promotion. So we got to go. Why are we getting all these negative interactions right now? And then my game is all choppy. What is going on? What's going on? We were doing good. We were doing so good game. Why in the world are you lagging on me? Here's your table. Enjoy your meal. Um, I'm just going to remind dad, you know, dad, I don't mind treating because I did just get a promotion. Thank you for inviting me out. But keep your budget limited. <laughs> I am on a limited budget. I think what I'm going to do, guys, is just let them kind of hang out for a little bit. And I'm going to switch back to Ahelia because that is who I kind of wanted to hang out with today. So we're going to switch back to Ahelia and let Reagan and her dad kind of catch up. I think it's been a while since they've had an opportunity to kind of hang out with each other. So let me do that. All right, guys, we are back at the crib, and it seems like Ahelia has like a full house. Everybody is still here, and she's in her little blow-up mattress kind of getting some Z's in. She's super tired, but it seems like everybody's still kind of here enjoying themselves, which is all about city living. But I'm going to check on her needs real quick. I mean, besides sleeping, she needs to have some fun. So I guess I'll just have her kind of get up and go, um, oh, I thought we knew Masoto. Have her come over here. Oh, Masoto's super flirty right now. And then um, let me go talk with Penny a little bit. Just kind of get to know. Uh, why is it just giving me other Sims? I guess I could ask about, I don't know. Ask about, oh, let's ask about Jason. See if she knows Jason. Because right now her and Jason have like a little budding attraction. We're just going to say that because it's not anything like the super serious Um I love the background of this this game this world oh my gosh I love it are you guys getting vampires by the way so it came out today and I'm still contemplating whether I'm going to get it or not I, I don't know I'm gonna have her vent a little bit and be like oh my gosh is there something fun to do around here because my fun level is just horrible right now so I'm gonna see if he wants to kind of like hang out and go do something fun let's see uh I guess we could discuss fashion a little bit what do we need to do for her job though um, no, get up, get up, girl. We're going to go have fun. Oh, she already researched fashion. Okay. So maybe me and Penny can kind of hang out for a little bit. Um, let's see. I'm going to share some photos with Penny. Um, I'm not sure why I need the other situations not coming up with Penny. Let's do friendly. Why can I only ask her about other Sims? I'm gonna be like, do you know Jason? Which is what I was trying to do earlier. And then see if Masoto wants to kind of go out, um, complain about her lack of boredom. <laughs> not her lack of board her, her lack of fun I said that completely backwards but anyway so I think I'm just going to do that let's just add them to the group and we're going to go hang out for a little bit somewhere maybe we'll go to the karaoke bar it is Friday so why not let's Friday in the game look how he's like oh my gosh are you serious he's, she's like I just moved out my dad can't stand me right now so let's just get out and have some fun okay all right so let's go do that I think I'm going to take them to let's do the stargazer lounge yeah let's do that all right hi guys we are at the stargazer lounge and we got kind of like a little crew with us i invited jason since uh well but did he show up oh i don't even think he showed up oh darn it okay and she's like so super stressed right now i i don't even know if it's because you know i don't even know but anyway <laughs> we'll come over here and let's order our favorite drink Let's order our favorite drink. Um, they're automatic. This only thing about coming over here, which I think is really, really nice. And it's got beautiful, I mean, surroundings. Like, check out these surroundings. Like, they are gorgeous. But it's kind of boring. <laughs> It's not like there's a DJ here. It's just like a very classy, upscale type establishment situation, which is fine. But um, I don't know how much fun she's going to have here. But we're going to give it a go. Uh, Mr. Bad Mr. Bad uh, Hair Day <laughs> is here. Remember, we saw him a couple episodes ago with Reagan. He got that baby hair popping right now. What did she get as her favorite drink? Girl, what did you get? What did you get? I'm trying to see. Oh, Dim and Gusty. Okay. Dim and Gusty. <laughs> <laughs> anyway i'm gonna let her send reagan a text and be like hey when you're finished with your dad come hang out we're at the starlight i'm gonna send her a text we're at the star i'm assuming she's still with her dad i'm assuming so but um they should be wrapping up because it's like midnight right now so i'm gonna let her send her a text and then maybe reagan can come through later on there's not really much to do here i was hoping that jason would have came um and maybe i could send him like a text message just to be like hey What's going on? He might be working because doesn't he work at the bar? 
I think he does work at the bar. I think he works at the um that's right. He works at the um at the hookah uptown hookah bar. So there's a strong possibility he is not going to be able to come. Um but you know, we'll 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 try anyway. Let me see. I'm going to see if he's going to try to come. Let me invite to hang out at the current lot see what he says. Let me see what he says. Like, "Hey, I was thinking about you. Look at our girl though." We got so oh there go Masoto. He's like, who are you texting? <laughs> Masoto's like, what's up with you? Now Masoto's our neighbor. If you guys didn't know, um, I think I we talked to him a couple of episodes ago. He's too busy to hang out. Okay, so I guess she'll just kind of like hang out with Masoto. I'm gonna discuss some neighborhood changes. Um, let's share some ideas. Let's get to know him a little bit. Let's show off muscles. Um. I'm surprised he, he's in a flirty mood, but he's like totally not trying to put the moves on her right now. I'm like ready for him to do it. And he's not. Let's discuss some interest. She has to use the bathroom though. Is she having? Okay. So at least she's having some fun, but not as much fun as she could be having. I guess you could say. I'm going to let her go use the bathroom and we're going to go on and toggle Reagan to come over here real quick. And Reagan's going to kind of hang out for a little bit. She's still at Villa Bovine. Hopefully she'll make her. There she is. Okay. Reagan, where are you, girl? Where are you? Where are you, girl? So Reagan is finished with her dad. We're going to act like she was <laughs> finishing up with her dad. She's coming over here in her formal attire. Uh, she's immediately going over to go get a drink, it looks like. Uh, let's see. Yep, she's going to order a drink. She's like, after that meeting with my dad, I wonder what they talked about. What kind of things did they discuss? She's thinking about the piano, must be, being ambitious with the piano. Um, oh my goodness, look at her face, though. She's not happy about something. I don't know what it is. I don't know what kind of conversation she had with her dad. Maybe her dad stressed her out a little bit. Like, you say you're doing okay, but are you really doing okay? I'm doing okay, dad. <laughs> Let's see what she's going to order herself. I like when they kind of toggle themselves. Look at this dude here. I'm impressed. Um, maybe she'll send, you know, I'll wait, to her, I'll wait for her to get a little couple drinks in her and then I'll let her send one of her little love interest a text. Um, Hunter is not even in the picture pretty much anymore and he is married. So maybe I could send um, Theo a text, see if he wants to come through. Uh, get your drink, girl. Which drink does she order? Oh, a sweet and spicy. Okay. So she's going to send him a text and then see if he wants to come out and hang out at the current lot for a little bit. Uh, we're just going to be trying to hang. I mean, it's Saturday. Well, it's for Saturday now. I was about to say it's Friday, but it's Saturday now. Okay. Sorry. I was getting all these updates on people updating life's um, life, not, not vampires. I'm going to say life vampires. <laughs> Theo is sleeping. Oh, okay. Well, we got to do something because honestly, Theo and Hunter are like the only people she had like a little smidge of anything with. And so it's one of those things where, um, I don't know. She's not having fun at all. Y'all. I think, I think Ahelia would totally be that girl that'll come over here and go skinny dip. I think she would. She'd be like, y'all, we got to spice this up. We got to spice this up just a little. I'm not having any fun right now. We need to do something. And Penny is about it. Masoto's about it. And look like Demi is about it as well. Are y'all about it? Come on. Don't get inside me, though. <laughs> oh, they are. They're all doing it. <laughs> Even Demi did it. I don't know. I must have some custom content that when they change into their nude, they end up putting on these pants or whatever. So is this fun? Is this fun? Reagan's just like, oh my gosh, I'm gonna have Reagan kind of come over here and be like, are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? A high hill you right now. Like, are you serious? Like she's, she's all about like the wildlife and trying to have fun and things like that. She's talking about moving right now. And Penny's like, <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm gonna share some ideas. I'm gonna splash Demi a little bit. And then I'm just gonna let her sit here. Cause that's, this is not, this is not her forte. Can we just sit? Can we just sit? No, we can just swim. So she's just going to look. <laughs> I guess if we just toggle up a conversation with them. No, come over here. Come over here, girl. Come talk to you, girl. I want to talk to Penny. Uh, not Penny. Well, yeah, I guess we can talk to Penny. She's not going to skinny dip, though. I know she's not. So let's just kind of discuss some work a little bit. She's going to be that person that's going to come over here and be like talking about boring stuff. <laughs> hate to say it but she is um i'm gonna brighten her day a little oh i didn't think she was gonna get in the water oh my god i need to give her a swim makeover look at these look at the swimsuit she still has on guys oh my god she's still so she's still so jaded and here ahelia is a skinny dipping <laughs> here ahelia is skinny dipping but is she having fun that is the question does this tickle her fancy it doesn't even tickle her fancy y'all oh my god she's tough she's a tough cookie to crack She's definitely a tough cookie to crack. Um, I don't know if Penny's coming back or what's going on, but um, 
Let's see what all the little movements she got going on right now. So she needs some amusement. She's sipping her drink from easy sipping, splashy fun. I'm going to have her splash Demi a little bit more and then do a deep conversation with Demi. Her and Demi actually have a really good um, relationship. Let's discuss some latest video games here. Let's do an inside joke. And she that's funny. She is the only one, y'all. Everybody else, well, Demi is, is particularly, went and put her bathing suit on. But she is the only one still in the in the pool, butt naked. <laughs> Bucket naked. <laughs> That is crazy. But anyway, guys, I'm going to wrap up this part here. I'm going to let them finish having their fun. And we're going to wrap it up. And we are going to um, go home after this. And I'm trying to see if there's anything else. There is nothing going on. What in the world? I need to find some happening spots to go to at this place. Because, oh, she wants to use? Oh, she wants to go use? Okay, let's go see her do that. She totally is, like, about that life right now. Her social is good, but her fun is still super low. Um, but she's totally, like, I'm about to go try this Uh. Is she going to get dressed? Oh, y'all, she's not even getting dressed. Ahelia is about that life. She's like, I'm just going to walk around here. I mean, technically she's dressed. <laughs> she has some custom content on that's messing up her, um, her, uh, oh, she's going to the bathroom. I thought she was going to go try the, um, the bubble machine. That's what I thought she was going to go do. Uh, she's not in a good mood though. I thought she was going to go do that. So I'm going to have her do it anyway. Let's sit and try. Um, but she's totally walking around here nude. She didn't even care. I wonder if that's a glitch or is that something else going on? Because I know the clothes she has on right now is a glitch. I've had that happen before. When they take baths or whatever, they toggle and put these these certain items on. I'm not sure why that happens, but she's going to try it. Try to have herself some fun. Uh, Reagan, on the other hand, is still in the pool swimming. I guess while she's in here, I'm just going to let her swim some laps a little bit. And I think Demi and everybody else is gone. And y'all, I think we stayed until the sunrise. Let's see. What does the sunrise look like? Where is it at? The moon's still out right there. Look at that. Oh, it's actually going down. Y'all see it? That is crazy. It's actually going down. But where's the sun? The sun only raises, raises, rises opposite of the moon, right? So the moon is still there. It's going down. That is crazy. I didn't even know that that happens. So the sun should be, oh, there's the sun. You guys see it? There it is. We stayed out till the sun came up. That's crazy. I love it. Oh, let's sit here and watch this for a while. Oh, I love it. I just wish that we could re like, look at these bridges and stuff. It reminds me of my SimCity build it. Um, I just was adding bridges and stuff yesterday to my uh, town. <laughs> Cause you could put bridges and water and stuff over. Oh, this has me a little bit inspired. Maybe I'll do some things different, but this is really pretty. Is the moon still, the moon is gone. Oh, the moon is still going down. Okay. And the sun is totally coming up over the horizon over there. That is really pretty. And where's our girls at? Where's our girls? Oh, hell, you're still walking around naked. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna go on and send them home so they can get some rest. I don't know. I think Ahelia doesn't go to work until Monday. And neither does, um, yeah. Oh, wait, no, Ahelia goes to work at four hours, y'all. Oh my gosh. Okay, y'all, I will see y'all next time. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you have a great rest of your day. Bye.